Welcome to another edition of Smart Chat here on YouTube.com and thank you for watching, liking, subscribing to my other channel. That's right, subscribing to my other channel, that's a Tom Brand one. Check it out, it's funny. And I um, want to do a video. If you're from the New York area, um, whether you're a Nick fan or not, which I'm not, uh, growing up in the 80s, 90s, uh, particularly in the mid-90s, if you're in around the New York area, one of the Knicks, back in the Knicks glory days, where you had a lineup of Oakley, uh, Ewing, Harper, Mason, that's a lineup that was of grit, hard-nosed, dirty players, quote-unquote, so to speak, defense, not afraid to go to the basket. Something that, um, if you're watching today's product, you're watching the Knicks, whatever team it may be, a lot of these players don't like to hustle, don't like to go to the basket. But um, back then, in particular, a player that uh, probably was a favorite, even though I'm not a Knicks fan, Respect the guy, and that was uh, Anthony Mason. Actually, uh, I uh, I have his autograph here from uh, back in the day of uh, Mace, and uh, met him. Probably this was around uh, mid '90s before he got uh, before he got traded. And uh, this guy Mason, probably known for his um, designs on, on the side of his head sayings. Uh, there was one that was a uh, mace in God's hands. There were quite a few of them. He was known for that. That was his trademark. But more importantly, he was known for his defense. A player who uh, was drafted by the uh, Trailblazers in 88, then got released, went to my Nets, got released as well, then played overseas in Turkey, and then Pat Riley... Uh, finally seen something in him. He caught his break. For five years here with the Knicks, a player that played defense. How rare is that now, right? A player that plays defense. And he was a decent scorer. Uh, after he was uh, tr traded, he went on to um, the Hornets, went on to the Heat, where he uh, was an all-star. He was also a six-man player of the year. Comeback player of the year. Just a all-around great player. New York legend. Uh, sad that he's gone. They don't make players like him nowadays. You know, and this was a player that um, at 6'7", he really didn't have a position. Kind of out of position. So it was hard to him to catch on. But when he finally did catch on with the Knicks, boy, was that a thing to watch. What a thing to watch. If only we had more players like Anthony Mason was back in the time that he was playing. Sad to, sad to hear that he passed away. Too young. Too young. Until next time.